guys welcome back to my channel so today this video i will teach you guys how you can use chatgpt4 for completely free so once you have hit this website cozy and you can start to create an account we'll click on get started here and in this case you can sign up with either your phone number or with your google account so i'm gonna click with google account which is very safe and convenient so and once you hit there, you can choose which account you want to go for and sign it up. And as after that, you will see this user interface. You click on the cookie accept button and you can see this one. A lot of people have created, you know, boards. Look at this. All right. So we'll create our own board. So we'll click on create board here and select personal wall space. You can give the borrower name, so I'll give it a ChatGPT4 or GPT4. Here you can see, and you can give a description, and I will just leave it blank here in this case. And you can also uh, give profile picture for the ball. You can also generate with the AI. Here you can see. In this case, I will just leave it default and click on confirm. And you have to wait for a while, so you will uh, get the brand new user interface. Here you can see that. And before you do anything, uh, I will show you guys. Here you can see the model. You can either choose GPT-4, AK, or more powerful one, GPT-4 Turbo, 128K. Uh, you can see that. I will choose this one. Or you, you also have the normal. GPT 3.5 with free version, but I will just show you guys with the most powerful GPT 4. Here you can see that, and then and you can see you can add a lot of plugins here. You can see that I'm gonna add a plugin. Click on here, confirm, and this was very useful. Google Web Search, you know, I'm gonna click add here. Definitely check it out this one because you can uh, search any information and web page URL from Google. And you can use the Google search engines. You need to, when you need to find information you know, about weather, exchange rates, their real time data. So, and then click on this one, GPT 4V. This one is very useful for advanced image organizations and analyzing images. Okay, add this one. Definitely add this one. Dell E3 is, you guys all know that, definitely use this one to create, you know, image very high quality image and you can also add the github here if you love programming if you love coding you know if you love developing software you can add this one and you can see news google scholars but in this case i'll just go with this data analytics which is very good for mathematics codings image processing and more so you can see that and here's capcad also um if you want to add this one, you can also add that. We'll have Google, Google uh, image search, and we have Google, which is uh, YouTube. You know, YouTube, you can uh, do captions and summarize the video if you don't want to watch the very long videos. You can see the Google image search here. Google image search is very useful, which is uh, you can search images, you know, if you want to add. Check it out, and this game is the don't uh, don't add this one. It depends on your preference. So here you can also see Wikipedia. Definitely check it this out. Wikipedia very useful to find informations, and you can find a lot of you know a lot of facts from the Wikipedia. Here you can see uh, last one I want to recommend is Document Readers. Definitely use this one. Uh, it can read PDF files, document files, test files. So I just add both of this, all right? And there are a bunch of other things as well. If you want to add, feel free to explore, you know. There are a lot of, lot of bots, a lot of uh, plugins that are very powerful, you know. You can see that, all right? Here you can see all the plugins that you have added. I'm gonna just click here. Definitely check this one long term memory and turn it on if you need long term memory. You know, it will still remember what 
conversation you have with it. So let's text it out. Hi, TB4. See that? Let's say um, create an image of a boy playing football. It will use a Dell E3 and other powerful AI to create realistic looking high quality images. So definitely use this one, feel free to use this one uh, to whenever like create thumbnails or create designs, logos, whenever just give it a great prompt and you can see it's complete uh, just wait and here you can see that it's very high quality looking you know look at even the sun all this um, let's try another one Ew. Just wait for a while, you can see that. Very high quality. Look at this. Really, really real estate. You can also check like this. Zooming, you know. Feel free to check it out. It looks very nice. You can see the ocean views. It is probably on the private yard or whatever it might be. Okay guys, that's it for today guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you did make sure you like and subscribe to my channel and feel free to use many modes here you can see, adjust temperature, precise, you know, whenever, you can also use a single agent mode or multi agent mode this way, multiple bots can be put right together to deal complex logic, complex problems, so very powerful one. Alright guys, thanks for watching once again. If you haven't liked this video, please like the video for YouTube algorithms. And I'll see you in the next video.